DC Comics. Now that I got you hooked, here's the ignorant review of the Flashpoint Paradox. We see Barry and his mom hitchhiking because their car broke down. Barry tried to chase a car down. His mom says, stop trying to save these hoes. You wasting time. So she look around and sees a gas station. I thought the first thing you did when you got stranded was look. But fuck do I know. Barry's coming home from school. He's so happy. It's his mama's birthday. He's skipping and shit. Open the door. His mom got packed up. Nigga just stood there like, damn. Now he all grown up and he visited her grave talking about some... <laughs> It's my fault. <laughs> I should have been there. Huh? The fuck would you have done? You was a sperm cell little nigga. You would have just got packed too. His girl had to talk some sense into him, but they was cooning at the Flash Museum. Yes, this thing is so clouded. He got his own museum. You better come correct. Boy gets blown up by some Beyblades, but the villain said, looks like you're the bottom and I'm the top? Excuse me? You know damn well what you just said. And my boy Flash is gonna beat the bottom allegations. Just watch. They got this man's whole road gallery in this bitch. We got let it rip, mirror nigga, boomerang dude, not Mr. Freeze, and Pyro from TF2. After he gets pinned down like the bottom he is, he did not beat them allegations. We get to see who really orchestrated this. The number one hater himself, stand up for Eobard Thawne, AKA Reverse Flash, AKA Professor Bitches. He's finna blow up the museum, the whole block, and the Flash. This nigga is efficient. He said, I don't have to kill all these people, but I feel like it. Flash goops him and he says, disarm the bombs or you die too. Bitch, you think I care about dying? I just want you cooked. We can both go to hell. So the Justice League swoops in and I'm gonna need Hal to shut the fuck up. I have never seen a clip of you in the DCAU where you're not getting bitched. They take the rogues far away and disarm the bombs. <laughs> Unless you a real nigga like soups and you just eat that hoe with ease and dust your hands off. I am not exaggerating when I say the Flash used the fucking Rasengan to destroy the bomb on Reverse Flash. Bro violating copyrights, I'm gonna need Naruto to lawyer up real quick. And this is where shit gets popping, cause Reverse Flash staring dude down like, be as fast as you want. You can't save everyone, not the ones that matter. He knew exactly what he was doing, cause saying this on his mom's birth and death day, he gigabrained this nigga so hard it's not funny. And he won, cause the Flash let that shit get to him. And he started running. We see him running through time and he wakes up at work. But Buddy sounding crazy talking about the Flash cause nobody knows who the fuck that is. He tried to run and end up busting his ass on the step and he's met with the face of his mother. He was gobsmacked. He says he feels weird and his mom said, yeah, I already know you're fruity. Just don't get none of that shit on my couch. Damn, I didn't know Barry mom had that dog in her bro cause she said that too quickly. Like she been knew your ass was gay. He tries to tell her he's the Flash and mama ain't know what he was on about. Who the fuck's the Flash? Meanwhile, we see Batman fighting Harley Quinn and he chucked her off the building. Cyborg saved her and Batman said, shoulda let her hit the pavement. Huh? Cyborg is a fed now, how unfortunate. Apparently there's a war going on between Atlantis and the Amazons. Barry went to see his girl and he was so happy until he sees that not only do she got a new nigga, she has a whole daughter. Boy cucked himself out of a girl, this is unprecedented. Nah, he was ready to end it all right there, in front of him too. Shit is bad right now. So he pull up to the Batcave just to get the craziest ass whooping I done ever seen. This Batman straight out of Arkham City the way he put them beaters on him because this Batman isn't Bruce Wayne it's Thomas Wayne because Bruce died in the alley that day and his parents survived random white guy gets choked by Wonder Woman shoulda been me she got this dumbass crown on absolute three out of ten accessory that shit looks stupid batman is just breaking barry's fingers while interrogating him like mention my dead son again and i'm breaking out the tools he shows thomas the flash suit he got and it looks like thawne's you know just to troll him and he blames thawne for changing something in the past to make this reality happen oh brother batman believes him and says he'll help him become the flash again pan over to lex Luthor and deathstroke take a good look at him and they're dead now stop worrying about it barry's in the bds 
DSM Charon gets struck with lightning, his ass is cooked well done, and we get the flashback to how this whole war started. And this is not it, bro. The Atlanteans and Amazons make peace. Then Aquaman and Wonder Woman have an affair, and Aquaman's wife walks in on him. Later, she goes into Wonder Woman's room to beat her ass, she gets beheaded, and Wonder Woman took her bummy ass crown. And the Atlanteans wanted to wage war for their murdered queen. Bruh, no dick is good enough to start a whole war over. I'm sorry, but that's just facts. And why did old girl try to press Wonder Woman because her man ain't shit? Now you got an ain't shit husband and you're dead. In the present, dude says, we'll get revenge for Queen Mora just to get sneaked by Aquaman. Keep my wife's name out your fucking mouth. And in past Gotham, we see Thomas Wayne beating the dog piss out of the guy that shot Bruce and his wife becomes the Joker. Back in the present, they turn Captain Adam into a Moab. Barry wakes up fried crispy and says, whew, all right, time for round two. That nigga's persistent, I'll give him that. Bats takes a swig and with some insane speed, plugs the shit back in that Barry kicked out. And now he's a Flash again. So, cool. Lewis, Lois, Lois, Lois? I cannot say this fucking name. Lewis, L Lois Lane? Fuck, man. Superman's baby mama gets saved as an excuse to show us that Thawn is just there, chilling. Barry takes that reverse flash suit and does some whatever the fuck to make it look like his colors again. He can't break the time barrier to fix this shit because he don't got enough speed force. Oh yeah, Hal's just an Air Force guy. He's not the Green Lantern because he didn't find the shits. He got bitched, really. Again, crazy, huh? The Flash asks, where the fuck is Superman? And they figure out that they need to break into a government building to go get him. So they call up Cyborg and Batman is like, fine, I'll help you, but we do it my way. So they break in, find a dilapidated Superman, and take old boy out to the sun so he can power up. The military decided to show up to try to stop him. Huge mistake, cause they're all dead now, since Superman couldn't control his powers. Can someone explain to me how you watch rockets and bullets do not a single thing? and you keep shooting, I'm going home. I'm putting the toys down because obviously I'm not, I'm not good enough to play in the big boy league. The final battle between the women and the wets is about to begin. And after Flash's adorable little pep talk, everyone's on board to help stop the war. But I know what you're here for. I'll give you the real fights. Wonder Woman and Aquaman get to scrapping and she finna hit that man with the link down there just for him to grab the ankle and drop the people's elbow on her ass. You murdered my wife, bro. Nah. Fuck you mean nah? Flash comes in and makes his shit with ease. Look at this extra shit, bro. He hit the punch run, punch run, punch run for absolutely no reason. Shazam is fighting Wonder Woman while they jump in Aquaman. Batman pulls out the 45 and headshots Black Mana just to get shot in the back by dude whose name I don't know. Flash sees Thawn and gets to blaming him ASAP. So they having a speed off or whatever. Man, speedster fights are not interesting to talk about. They run fast. What do you want me to say? That's it. Flash does get his shit rocked though. Pulled through the leg and all. What did you do, Thon? Bitch, you did this. I ain't do a thing. Weave, weave, punch. You could have stopped Hitler, nigga. But you saved mommy. And now look at the world. How you gonna call me the villain? Nah, Aquaman's violating. He doing too much. He dismantled Cyborg and exposed that man's heart. I think we need to dial it back a bit. Oh, never mind. Wonder Woman made Shazam go back to being little kids and immediately killed them all. Nah, this is outrageous. Superman pulled up and beamed Aquaman's arm off. So hey, at least Cyborg got saved. Nope, I lied. He saw the woo. GG's. Wonder Woman sneaks Aquaman and before she make him see God, he pushes the button on his belt to unleash the tactical nuke. The thing is, he knew he lost the war, but he was fine killing everybody just cause the coochie was not that good bro let her go and i don't know why barry thinks saying you'll die too means a thing to the reverse flash he'll happily die just to fuck with you bro stop saying that goofy ass shit since i'm here you can't get enough speed force you can't escape i win bullet straight through the dome because thomas is a real one bruce could fucking never thomas hands a letter to the flash to give to bruce and tells him to fucking go now he's running through time to stop his past self from changing the further past to prevent the present which is also the future i don't know if any of that shit made sense but guess what and i ain't finna re-record it pussy bro really had to fight himself to stop himself he's back in his time he got his girl back he gives the letter to bruce now bruce crying like a bitch and that's the end of the movie. And that's the end of this video. It's been your boy Demi Darko, and I'll see y'all niggas next time. Peace.